All right, John Coast Race R&D again. Well, today we have a little Subaru flywheel on our lathe, and what we're going to be doing is cutting off this inertia ring on the back. This is going on a blower motor, and uh, the guy's concerned that he have a little bit of weight on the flywheel so that the thing will idle properly. But we are going to be taking some material off. I want to show you how that's done. All right, well, we've got this thing trimmed up pretty well. We've got it all machined down to where the customer wanted us to machine it to. So we're going to pop this off and put it on the scale and see how much it weighs. And then we're going to put it over on the balancer and recheck the balance. Well, we've got our flywheel mounted on the machine. So we'll go ahead and see what happens here with this, see how far it's out. What this will do is ramp up to about 500 RPM and if it likes what it sees at that point then it'll ramp even higher up to about close to 700 RPM thereabouts. Alright, looks like we're about 2.9, 2.1 grams out. So we'll make a correction on this and rebalance. Alright, we made one correction here, so we'll see how this does. And there we have it. We got this down to zero zero, which is where it needs to be. If you have questions about flywheel lightning or flywheel balancing, give me a call here at Costa Mesa R&D. We'll see you soon.